player. But here we go. We're going to do Weavile versus Machamp. This matchup is interesting to say the least. Sky Reason, um, I think, knows the matchup pretty well. But Machamp in general just has a power, a huge, huge power advantage. Um, so let's see what can uh, work out for Sky Reason. Paper is going to be able to land that projectile, but not uh, confirm a combo off it. Good knowledge here from Sky Raisin not to carry through with the attack, otherwise he would have ran into the trap and thus been punishable. Test each other out. Good. Fury Swipes covering the vulnerable frames and able to cover that forward wide. Sky Raisin, however, going to get a close combat, shift it back into field, and look at that damage. That exactly. Why Machamp is such a difficult matchup for some characters is just because of the immense power. That Ice Skate Slide on block is punishable on the second hit. Synergy activation going to bump back the pressure. Sky is just going for that yellow grab. Going for the homing on block. Sky is going to be able to land his homing. Ooh, the grab is going to get busted. Throws out Dragonite for an Oki. Repeat JX, you gotta be careful with that. Able to land the Night Slash though, not able to combo off of it. You can land a, a uh, just a regular Y combo off of it and at least get a knock off. Oh, but drop the shield unfortunately at the last second against the uh, the shoulder tackle. Victini activated, that's gonna get some uh, automatic crits during combos for Weavile. We'll see how this goes. Now, Sky Reason is doing a very intelligent thing in the Wheel Out matchup, and that is breaking the traps. Uh, very, very important to kind of cancel out Weavile's pressure in this matchup. Unfortunately, not uh, taking advantage of the cross up. Ooh, a little misspaced on the slide, which otherwise would have been safe. Sky Reason is going to be able to confirm a combo and get the air grab, keep it in phase. Lots of damage. Keeping the pressure on with the Synergy Activation, 5XX bumping up against the wall, goes for the close combat, and that is going to close it out. Sky Raisin taking game one. All right, moving into game two here, no changes. Goes in with homing attack, which is a punish against the traps. Goes for the uh, 4XY. Is going to be able to get punished. Goes for short shoulder tackle. Always try to counter that. Don't try to challenge you with anything else. Chances are you will lose. Just counter it. Goes for 5XX on block. Just take that. Do not uh, try to uh, counter it or anything because it does uh, break counters. And Blocky puts some plus, so. Able to land that air grab and is going to take the kill. Able to land that forward Y. There's that Dragonite. Not able to grab in time due to the forward dash. Land that counter attack. for Synergy Activation while in the corner. Go to, tries to go for grab, but Synergy Activation will bump that back. Oh my gosh, trying to commit to the submission. Able to hop around, block in time against the burst. Activate Togekiss. Try to go for the submission as well. Able to combo into the burst before the Synergy runs out. Very good confirmation there from Paper Sack. It's going to drain enough Synergy to knock him out of uh, burst mode. Try to get around uh, her traps for safety, but the projectile is going to break it. Try to go for a ground. The homing attack is going to break that. Trying to find opportunity for pressure here. 4XY working out. Just testing each other out. Try to go for a slide, but the uh, a little too late. Able to get the guard crush, though, with the 8X into the Fury Swipes. Goes for the Oki with Dragonite. Try to use an Icicle Crash to see how... Sky Raisin will respond. 
able to catch his toes there. Not able to snag a vulnerable frame there. Ooh, able to avoid that cross chop. But the JY is going to confirm. Oh my gosh, the 4Y coming in clutch against that 5XX. He charged uh, the 5XX, giving him an opportunity to use that 9 frame, or I'm sorry, excuse me, 11 frame into the uh, frame data correction. Um, and from that, going for the knockoff for Synergy Drain. Good option there from Paper. Gets the grab, throws it back into field. Create some distance. Don't want to get close now. Able to anti-air, but it trades. Gets a homing attack, though. Back in duel. Goes for Dragonite. It is going to land. Not able to block in time, so she is also going to be able to land that knockoff confirmation as well. Ooh, unfortunately, the Butt Bomb is going to snag the Icicle Crash. Tokis activated here. Goes ahead and activates Synergy. Just trying to get a cross up. Not able to land that JX. Alright, so a little bit of shield stare there. She is going to be able to get a Y combo in the grab for the Oki. It's looking good here for paper. Trying to go for that double icicle crash. Uh, it's called Signal Slash in that case, and it charges support. But Paper Sack is going to be able to get that anti air and snag game two. The anti air working out just in time to snag the vulnerable frames of the counter attack. And we're going to move into game three. I've been muted, sorry. Alright, Paper Sack is going to go ahead and activate uh, Synergy. Keep on the pressure. Trying to call out a jump. Ooh, Skyrace is going to uh, win the homing attack battle there. Goes for the Dragonite. Going to be able to block it. Goes for the submission just in time. That counterattack is not landing. Go kiss activation. Able to counter in time against the Night Slash. Ooh, able to avoid the counterattack though with the uh, 2x. Okay, okay, I wasn't sure if the Spire was going to be big enough to catch. So that is going to confirm round two and thus game three going to Sky Racing. Alright, so who do we got left here?